class is in session. This is Professor Ganymede. We are going to start our first of our uh, uh, subscriber analysis for our 10,000 subscriber, you know, event where I said on every, on this video I made, uh, on the 10,000 event video, I'm going to be reviewing every, every um, gameplay that is submitted. So I'm starting now. Um, so about my GoFundMe, I've just I've decided based on feedback from you guys that I'm actually going to start my GoFundMe at the end when I've re when I've after I've reviewed all the videos on this and there's like a ton a ton of gameplay. You guys went out of your way. I mean, there's so much gameplay. Um, so I should I will have this done by Sunday and then I'll start my GoFundMe to help me uh, save up for when I will be traveling to Europe. And my expenses and all that but not yet though I want to earn it so that's why I'm gonna do this first and then I'm gonna earn it so first we have Apple Pylon and we're gonna review this gameplay again we may not review all the gameplay but we'll review hey, some man, of it this guy's playing McCree all right fine that, that said I'd do it so let's do it let's see how this guy positions as McCree let's see what he's gonna do as McCree oh yeah Good as best I can. Uh, that's sad. <laughs> so uh, he missed that. Uh, he missed that. That's that's wasted. I'm not sure how. I mean, I, I don't play DPS, but I'm not sure. He definitely doesn't want to do that. Like I, I can definitely identify when he doesn't want to, you know, waste his uh, his little flashbangs like that because it's on. What is it? Ten second cooldown or nine second cooldown? Um. And then it was a diva. I'm not even sure you'd. I, I'm, I'm wondering because does diva's ground uh, her little defense matrix? Does that block the flashbang? I mean, what did you even get a lot of value out of flashbang her? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Let's just keep going. Yeah, definitely don't want to do that. Oh, nice shot. Maybe behind. Maybe behind. Nice shots. Okay, this is someone you definitely want to flashbang if you can. Oh my god. Oh my. <laughs> that was just uh, that was uh, that was sad. Let me watch that again. I want to see that. Okay, you okay? You see this? Do you see this? He actually doesn't have a flashbang when he engages this man. Um, this having his flashbang here would definitely helped. Um, so I'm thinking that, I mean that that him wasting his flashbang earlier would have definitely, you know, definitely added up to so him being dead here. And then he just can't aim properly. He almost killed her though. He he shot and he punched instead of uh, instead of shooting her down. Uh, that's just you know you, you just want to practice your aim and you know and you do that by you know go go to um who is it Skyline's video I think it's Skyline or there's a really good guide and uh, on aiming practice go to that video and 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 practice what he teaches you I think it's Skyline because. Having better aim here could have le definitely led to that me being dead. Yeah, okay. I have uh, someone in my chat default. He just freaked out. Should have saved ammo for when she ran out of corner. Out of corner. Okay, yeah. So it definitely looked like you panicked there. Um, so uh, less panicky. Less panicky. But, more, but the aim, having um, better aim would have ended her. And then you'd be alive. I've got all. Okay. Let me, let me rewind that here because I wasn't really paying attention. I mean, like, ah, again with the wasted flashbang. So Diva was already dead. Like Diva's mech was already done, and she just wasted a flashbang. Um, I mean, Diva's so big. Do you even really need to flashbang her to to get your shots in there? I mean, are you are you gonna miss? Like the flashbang is to keep someone still while you hit your shots. But Diva's so big that can, you can just just aim her down. Just aim her down. And then you won't uh, you know miss flashbangs like that. Niles, Hamfist Jones, what's up, guys? Uh oh, nice. Oh, nice, nice yeah, roll, yeah, nice, nice roll. Oh man. Um, so I noticed you're not talking in this game. Um, you, you it'd be good to call out that the McCree is flanking behind you, because then that your turn could be, could have potentially turned around. You could have, and you wouldn't have to die there. You could stay in the corner until your team distracted the McCree. So um, play, communication would. I mean, your team's clearly listening, and, and they're in chat, so making some Increased calls. Super split. I think we're okay. Just would have definitely helped. Like I'm listening. Yeah. Lucio's talking, which he should be. Okay, there. There's your voice. 
Okay, Zarya's talking. You want to add to that since they're talking, they're going to listen to you. Um, oh my. Okay. Okay, so there's the high noon, and you didn't get anything out of that. And, and let me tell you why. Because the Reinhardt had full shield. Like, you, like, I'm not sure what you're trying to accomplish there. I mean, you heard the, the enemy high noon, and then you high noon. Um, when the enemy has full shield and you're not, and you're not flanking, um, I mean, you're just going to typically... The enemy is going to move behind the shield. Even even low level players are going to move behind Reinhardt shield because they know that your your McCree oh can't burst through his shield and kill them. So, um, so just keep that in mind. Just keep that in mind. Want to be aware of the shield. Apprentice Mustard, what's up, guys? Thanks. Welcome to the ten thousand subscriber subscribe the ten thousand subscriber analysis. Yeah, both of those today. Viewer analysis. This is an event. Okay. We're going to be doing like, we should, we're probably going to be doing this all day. Oh, there you go. There you go. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to see. Much better. There you go. Okay, he just went off. He just went ham. He just went ham sandwich. Okay, you should kill her. Kill her. Kill her. She should be dead. That, it's your job to kill Farrah. Like, that's. It is your uh, job. Yeah, Since yeah. you're taking one of the hit scan characters, you, well. you need to kill her. But that was really good how you went we went ham in those peoples. Oh, I like your positioning here. Not in position to get ha hammered down. Yes, yes good. Yes. You, that I love that. Because you were positioning off to the side, you're able to not get hit by you know hammered down and get charged with this. And then you just kind of like move behind this truck here. Uh, and just kind of smash his face. Um, and when, when you move behind this truck, you like block yourself off from getting shot from the side because you know this blocked the end. Can you guys even see my mouse here? Yes, you are. I don't even think you guys can see my mouse. But I'm definitely mousing it up here. Let's try this again. Yeah, so that was really good. There we go. That was a, that was a good high note in there. That was a, okay. Let me let me explain why that was a good high note. Alright, kill everything, it's only that. Go ahead and get it. Got any ad analysis plan? I'm pretty sure I do. I'm gonna be reviewing all of all there's like a hundred videos or something like that. But anyways, that was a really good um that was a really good uh, high noon, and you know why? Because Reinhardt was dead. And he was coming back and he wasn't gonna be able to put his shield up fast enough to save his team, which is why you got that kill on that May. And May is a really high target target to kill, so that was just really good. Um so now oh, you got to see and you get the back up and smash so the get a McCree up top. Okay. Now they have a McCree. Yeah, but... McCree's up top to the right. You guys should be pushing it forward, though. It's high. Yeah, you know, it's just like straight up. Well, to the right, to the right, to the right. Okay. Oh, jeez. Yeah, good kill. Good kill. You guys pushed it to the next point though, so you can be back here and just throwing down damage. I like your positioning. I do like your positioning. I think you could be closer to reduce your. Um, I think you could be a little bit closer, like up here, like right here instead of back there, or maybe even over here next to this health pack, in order to reduce your uh, damage fall off. But that's like it's very risky, so you need to have a really good grasp on McCree and get a good grasp of Ain in order to be there. But you can definitely be pushed up here a little bit more. Uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna fault you for playing it safe though. Not yeah, gonna fault you for playing it safe. Um, okay, you're shooting at this right heart. right now. You need to be shooting at them. You need to be going to kill that Mercy because my Mercy is keeping him up. You need to switch targets because uh, she needs to die. Okay, there you go. Oh, good kill. So, um, you don't actually need the ult here, and I, and I'll tell you why. Because you guys got the second point. You're gonna overwhelm them, right? You, you, your team is just gonna overwhelm them. It's just gonna happen. Um, now, I suppose McCree builds his ult relatively fast, and his ult isn't the the most game breaking thing, but it's still very useful. Uh, really, if you just went, walked up, killed that, you know, flashbang, and killed that mercy, um. 
or maybe not even flashbang, just just shoot her in the head, maybe either kill their gun out of the fight. You would have pushed them off this point. Like they can't hold right now, since you, your your spawn is right there. They cannot hold. Increase still the right. Increase half and right. Good, good flashbang. Yeah, like like I said, like they can't hold. They're they're close. They're close. To, they're close. They are too close to your spawn. Even I've got a pretty bear. That's you. That's all you. Oh. Mercy's lit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You gotta get a little bit of better grasp on that flashbang range because he did completely whiff that mercy. Three more feet, you would have got that mercy, and then shoot him a dead. It's a little just comes with practice, though. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh, there's there's heavy. Um, no, Alright, that's fine. I there's some pretty heavy um, sound sound lag in game. I just realized. Um, so the, your positioning here was um, not the best. You're kind of in the middle of nowhere, which means you couldn't really react to damage being dealt at you. You want to be next to cover. I mean, there's cover right here. Alright, that's fine. I still. Have um, so you, you see, there's cover over here, and then there's cover right here. I would have actually probably been like right here. Um, if not, just or I mean, you're McCree. You could just sneak around up to the top of here and be up up on this ramp up there. Um, I mean, there's so many places you can be that's not in the middle of this road where you have no cover at all. So you you do want to play next to cover and then you know kind of do your little weaving out in and out of line of sight, like shoot, 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 shoot. Um, just so you oh, avoid okay. things like that. You pay, maybe position to be able to avoid this blizzard. How you been near cover? Do a ton of alts. We're good. Let's see. Use that guys. That so here's the thing with McCree. As McCree, um, you don't really have the obligation to be next to your team like a support player does. Like you don't need to see your team. You can be doing your own thing as long as you don't die while you're doing it. Now it's better that you can travel with your team because it makes you more safe. It reduces the chance that you're going to get picked off. Um, but you can be away from your team. You could be really, you know, you can be a medium distance away from the fight. Um, so that makes it, that makes you a little bit safer than, say, a Mercy. Because she, she has to be on the front lines so and you don't have to be there. Oh God, I'm so sorry. <laughs> as long yeah. as you don't die, then you can actually go do some flanking and stuff. Like... Just leave her as in. long as you don't I die. I still advise my McCrees to follow the team though. It's much safer. Get over the right, get over the right, get over the right. Unless they make a specific plan with their team, like, I'm going to go flank, and you guys do this while I flank. You know, that's one thing, but most of the time, just follow the team. But stay safe while you do it. Increase behind you guys, increase behind you guys. He's coming They're pressing fire. Yeah. You can totally hit those shots, by the way. You can totally hit those shots. All right, just oh, my. Okay. So I feel like you're just kind of like throwing out those flashbangs kind of willy-nilly just because you have it. Um, I think you want to, I think what you, what, I, what I'd like you to see you do is hold on to those flashbangs a little bit longer and only use those flashbangs when you need it, like um, like when you need it, like at the last moment. I want, I want you to practice using your flashbang too late as opposed to using it too early and then slowly scale it up. Because, I mean, you can clearly see that she used that flashbang when you didn't need it. Um, and if you're a little bit more patient with those flashbangs, you might save those. And, you know, not having your flashbangs has definitely, we've already seen, led to some really bad situations. Oh, fuck, that's carefully just... Oh, oh yeah. Uh, so I'd seen if there was an opportunity to do a Earth Shatter, that would have taken out both their healers, but... Uh... Good flashbang, I like that, I like that. No, oh, great. See, that's that's the power of the flashbang. You can do so much work with that flashbang. Reaper's behind us. I'm probably dead. Yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> this this is about that just okay. involves having a little bit better. Down. Anyway, I'm actually gonna try to set up this alert thing for this window right quick. All right, there we go. Uh, I should probably make this a little bit smaller. Okay, there we go. All right, anyways, back to the game, guys. So next time someone does something, actually, let me let me test the alert right quick. Um, 
Okay. Test. There we go. It works. I'm gonna rewind. I think no, I can just see it right now. We got a ton of vaults. Let me fade the background. Right. No, I'm gonna rewind. I want to see exactly what led up to this death. Let's go. So you got the pro kill on the mercy. Oh, yeah, good. Go. The pro kill. Reapers and then you you moving over here and you just time have a down. hard time killing this guy. Nice job, guys. Okay. May. May out down. down. Uh, okay. What I'd like to see you do there, first of all, get the kill on Lucio. But also start moving back towards the health pack behind you. Um, there's a health pack behind you. Like, you see that room? You see that room? There's a health pack behind you, so. Um, yeah. Get the kill. And then you, you use your dodge roll because you're trying to reload. Had you just got the kill at Lucio, you just saved your dodge roll, and then you could have dodge rolls back. You see how, how all these, like, you know, how, how all the small things add up to you dying? Like, it, it really adds up. Let's see. Uh, GV. I think he needs to be a little more deliberate with his shots. He should take an extra moment to make sure his shots are lined up. Good. I, I agree with that advice. Good advice from a stream here. Good advice. Just, uh, yeah, take your awesome. time. Take your time yeah, a little bit more with those shots. Because killing that, killing that Lucio, you definitely should have secured the kill that Lucio. That would have led to you living. Very potentially if you had you secured the kill that Lucio. May's gonna die. May's so low. He's a trail. Watch there. He's up top to the right. Uh, can see. Okay, now he is doing some flanking. Okay, he needs to back up. He's right. Yeah, we can. Okay. All right. All right. Before anything that happens, what does he plan to accomplish here? Like, three of his teammates just died. There is nothing. I mean, let's say he gets you now two kills. His team's not going to get back to the fight in order to capitalize on the two kills. They, the fight's too close to the enemy spawn. Like, he needs to back up and make sure he doesn't die, because if he dies here, he staggers his team really badly. So he does not need to be here. Let's see. Uh... Like, do, you have, do you have data? Yeah, you can grab stairs, Jedi. Okay, he doesn't die, though. Here we go. He regroups with his team. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to see. Regrouping with the team. Dude, we all we should get pushed through. Oh. What I want. William. I he's not, no, he's I'm not playing some Yana, dude. He's playing. William, you're, you're getting all the heals you can get. Yeah. Maze on the left. She's Mercy's down. Mercy's down. Oh. Maybe we're standing. Oh. Damn. <laughs> he just got outplayed there. He just got out. Bruh. I, I don't even know what to say about that. It just got... <laughs> he just got outplayed. That was nasty. That was nasty. Nice job, guys. Um, All right, you tell me when had he been with his team a little bit more, he might have been able to have his team protect him from that. But that was just... Uh, that was just sad to see. <laughs> it, uh, it happens, though. It happens. Oh Seven. shit, there's so much lag. Oh, he didn't build enough, enough damage. Yeah, wait. So, uh, so McCree's damage builds 170 per, um, 170 per second. So, he didn't build enough damage to kill that Reaper. And he didn't really need, even need the ult there. Like, if there's only like a Reaper in his sights, uh, he needs to get up here and ult. Use an ult so he can try to hit more than one person. I mean, he could have just shot at that Reaper and killed him um, for proper aim or, or flashbang. That's flashbang I'll throw down. So, uh, if you can get your, your kills without using your high noon, do it. Oh, man. <clears throat> do it. Do it. Do it. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes, that's what I'd like to see. Good job. Good job on that. Dark Reapers. Thanks for following. Thanks for following. Welcome to the Elevation nation. Yes, there we go. So let's see. And he's moving. Okay, I like this positioning he's going through. I like how he's using a. No, he's not. Uh, he's not one hit. Until the end there. I like that he used the the little walls. It was kind of like moving, trailing over here. No, he's not. He's not one of my hits. I really like that. Like yeah, he was using this. He was kind of moving over here. 
What I'd like to see him do, though, instead of moving out towards the people, towards the bunch of people with no Reinhardt shield in front of them, I'd like him just to use this corner and just be like, ha, 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 ha. I mean, because you're you slowly getting fall off, but if you're hitting your shots, you would have killed them. Maybe not all of them. You would have not died there, definitely, and you probably would have killed one or two of them. Just ha, ha. Just be a little bit more con you know, conservative, uh, unless your aim is like godlike. <clears throat> conservative with your positioning. Is he down? I have my ult still. I still have my ult too. Uh oh, I can switch the tracer. I'm here. I'm here. He's a train. Maze low. And she's. I'm coming in. I have my ult. Good focus. Oh, it's, still, it's right in front of head. That's what I like to see. Focus on that uh, mercy. Yeah. God damn. Nice dragons. Okay. Well, that was that. Um, so that was, was Apple Pylon giving me the McCree gameplay. Um, thanks for submitting this, guys. Um, I hope that helped you out. Um, let me, let me, uh, yeah, so thanks for submitting that. I hope that helped you out. Um, yeah, um, we'll be doing a lot more because I have to finish all the comments, all the video, uh, all the videos that were submitted to this comment section, which is like, I think 50 or more. I don't know. I haven't actually counted. Anyways, let's get to do it. So thanks for watching. This has been Professor Ganymede. Class dismissed.